Hey everybody, and as my good friend Ross, King Ross said, feed the world and let them know it's Christmas time again. We are gonna feed the WCPW fans by giving them a full YouTube special this coming Monday night, March 6th. You can get all the information and you can watch live at youtube.com forward slash WWE. We have a stacked card of action coming at you and we're gonna run it down right now so you know what to expect for this coming Monday. Up first, we have a Rev Pro Showcase match. What Culture Pro Wrestling have developed a relationship with Rev Pro, so they are sending two of their stars to have a match this coming Monday night. We're gonna have Marty Scuttle, who is no stranger here in WCPW, and he'll be taking on David Starr, making his debut appearance in What Culture Pro Wrestling. We were all heartbroken together when James R. Kennedy betrayed Prospect. Alex Gracie and Lucas Archer were betrayed by their mentor, their confidant, James R. Kennedy, and now Prospect are coming for retribution, but James R. Kennedy is bringing the backup. It's gonna be Bad Bones and Drake taking on Prospect this Monday night. Bad Bones again has been hired, the hired assassin. What will he do to Prospect? Will Prospect be able to overcome Bad Bones and Drake to try and stick it to James R. Kennedy? We're gonna find out. When Joe Henry turned his back on Kurt Angle at True Destiny, little did we know that he was not alone. Two weeks later on Loaded after a match with Alberto El Patron, Travis Banks and Joe Coffey showed their true colours and joined Joe Hendry. So therefore this coming Monday night, El Leguero and Gabriel Kidd are going to seek some retribution on El Patron's behalf when they take on Travis Banks and Joe Coffey in Newcastle. And the WCPW Women's Champion B Priestley will be in action this coming Monday night defending her title. It's safe to say that B Priestley's had some help in the past to retain her championship, but this coming Monday night is one of her toughest tests to date. Making her WCPW debut is Kaylee Ray, Scotland's own Kaylee Ray. She's wrestled across the world, Japan, Europe, the UK, you name it. She has been there and she is coming this Monday night for the championship when she takes on B Priestley in Newcastle. Martin Kirby is our What Culture Pro Wrestling general manager, but only for a few more days because he steps back in the ring this coming Monday night in Newcastle when he takes on BT Gun, a match that we've not seen before here in WCPW. People want to see Kirby back in the ring. He is coming this coming Monday night and he's going to take on BT Gun. Speaking of Martin Kirby, he is no longer going to be the What Culture Pro Wrestling general manager, so this Monday night we are going to find out who the new WCPW general manager will be. Who is it? I don't know. I've been trying to ask everybody, trying to get the scoop. As Steve Edding would say, the huge scoop! But I can't get it. I don't know who it is. So I'm going to be there Monday night to find out who my new boss is, and we'll find out who the new WCPW general manager will be. Pray it's not Jack the Jobber. Pray it's not Jack the Jobber. The best of seven series has been taking its toll on both Primate and Rampage, and right now Rampage is winning 3 2. Primate needs to win this Monday night in the Chains match, the sixth match in the series. Can Primate get that equaliser and take it to the last match, or will Rampage be able to shut the Primate up for good? We love showcases here at WCPW, so Ring of Honor will be having a showcase match this Monday night at Exit Wounds. Delirious will be taking on Silas Young, two staples of Ring of Honor wrestling. They will be coming across the pond to show us all what they've got this coming Monday night in Newcastle. Our WCPW internet champion is back. Cody Rhodes is coming back this coming Monday at Exit Wounds, and he will be defending the internet championship live on YouTube for free as always and he's going to be defending against Liam Slater. Obviously we've seen a huge win recently for Liam Slater against Zack Sabre Jr and that's now given him an internet championship shot against Cody Rhodes. Can Liam Slater grab another upset? He's famously said that sometimes people think he's just another guy, that it's Johnny Moss and the guy. Liam Slater wants to make a name for himself. He did it against Zack Sabre Jr. Can he continue that trend at Exit Wounds by defeating Cody Rhodes and come, becoming the new WCPW internet champion? Cody's back and he's not coming to lose. And finally, the WCPW Championship will be on the line in the main event as Will Ospreay, one half of the WCPW Tag Team Champions, vows that he will win the championship and defeat Drew Galloway live in Newcastle. Drew Galloway has had a lot of contenders here for his championship. Will Ospreay is very confident that he is going to win. We've seen in the past that Will Ospreay is not above having people interfere on his behalf to get the job done. Will Will Osprey walk out of Exit Wounds with the WCPW Championship, or will Drew Galloway be able to retain it and take it to Orlando and defend it on WrestleMania weekend? We're gonna find out this Monday night. What a stacked card it's gonna be this coming Monday night at Exit Wounds, and you can see the entire event for free on our YouTube channel. We've got so much coming, the WCPW Championship on the line, the Internet Championship on the line, Kaylee Ray debuting to try and defeat B Priestley. We've got the best of seven series continues. So much is gonna happen, and you can check it all out for free live on our main YouTube channel, youtube.com 
forward slash WhatCulture WWE. Exit Wounds kicks off local time at 7.15pm here in the UK. If you're in the Eastern Time Zone of the US, it's 2.15 for you in the afternoon. And if you're a Pacific, if you're in the West Coast, if you're lucky to live in like California, where you get sunshine, and I never do, it's 11.15am in the morning. You can roll out of bed and watch Exit Wounds. We hope you'll join us. It's going to be a great show. I'm, I'm very excited. The new What Culture General Manager will be there. The new WCPW General Manager will be in the house. I'm dreading who it might be, but we're going to find out this coming Monday. We hope to see you there.